So here's the basic equipment for the lab. There's a projectile launcher, the stand, there's a photo gate, calculator, CBL, the bag, safety goggles, plumb bob, a meter stick, and then down on the floor, there's going to be a target sheet underneath that piece of carbon paper over there. So that's the basic setup. So here's the ball launcher. Photo gate's right over the top of it. And then the CBL unit is connected by a cable up to the photo gate itself. The photo gate works by having these two little holes and a little beam of light goes across between these two little holes. So the holes are right here in the photo gate. And these holes need to be lined up with the center of the ball that's in there. So when you're looking at it, it needs to be lined up right across the width of the ball itself. Because what's going to happen is the photo gate is actually going to measure the time it takes for the ball to go through the photo gate. So width divided by time, that's going to give us our velocity. So that'll tell us how fast the ball is coming outside of the, t outside of the gate. So to measure the range, I've got my plumb bottom line marked, the center of the ball. And then following all the way down there, that's where I'm going to start measuring the range. And then it goes out to my prediction sheet where it predicts where it's going to land. So in this case, I'm saying 74 centimeters. So I'm going to put my little prediction mark there at 74 centimeters. Then what I'll do is I'll lay a piece of carbon paper over top of it before I'm ready to fire. Don't forget, get the teacher before you fire the ball for the first time.